Good morning, Cedar Hill. Today is Monday, October 3rd, and it's National Mean Girls Day. So celebrate it by heading to Netflix and check in on Regina George. MTV starts now. My name is Zoe, and here are your announcements. Today, the case 21 for English writing is today, so prepare for that. Tomorrow, there will be an Ole Miss recruiter in the comments around 12 noon, so don't be afraid to stop by and say hey. Mark your calendars as homecoming week is next week. Here are the days to be sure you don't miss it. Tuesday is career day. Dress up as your desired career. Wednesday is parent day. Dress up as a mom or dad. Thursday is music genre or music artist day. Dress up as your favorite artist or music genre. And Friday, as always, is Spirit Day. Seniors wear black, juniors wear white, sophomores wear red, and freshmen wear gray. In case you need a ray of sunshine, the end of this nine weeks is Thursday, with report cards coming out next Thursday. Here's what's happening at the Hill. Tonight, the football team is playing an away game against Lake Cormor at Lake Cormor High School. Please try to come out and support your Mustangs. Here is your breakfast, lunch, and weather report. Happy birthday to our Sunday birthdays, Madeline Hood, Trevor Luttrell, and Louis Romero. For our today birthdays, happy birthday to Aaliyah Kelly and Preston Reese. Those whose birthdays we missed over the weekend, happy belated birthday. Here's Luis with your tea time. Several medical conditions we don't know much about. Well, October's the time to learn more and help out with breast cancer. Wear pink and support those who have it. I'm Luis and it's time to get educated for Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Breast cancer is a type of cancer that starts in the breast. It happens when the cells in the breast go out of control. It most commonly occurs with women, but men can get it as well. <music> Lifestyle causes of breast cancer includes drinking alcohol, being overweight, not being physically active, not having children, not breastfeeding, birth control, menopausal hormone therapy, and breast implants. Although there are factors you can't change like family history of breast cancer, being taller, starting your period early, genetics, and getting older. The highest risk factor of breast cancer is getting old. Most breast cancers develop in women in their 50s and men in their 60s. The older you get, the higher the risk it is for you to get it. It's not something we can change, but there are some ways we can help prevent breast cancer in our lifetime. Be physically active. Try to maintain a healthy diet and weight, and avoid or limit alcohol consumption. For those who are in high risk of breast cancer, you can use medicine to lower risk, do preventive prophylactic surgery, and do close observation to look for early signs of breast cancer. There are symptoms to breast cancer that you need to watch out for so you can get an early detection. These include a new lump or mass on your breast, swelling, skin dimpling, breast pain, and swollen lymph nodes under the arm or near the collarbone. However, most people who have breast cancer have no symptoms, so the best way to get early signs is to do screenings. For example, mammograms, breast ultrasounds, and breast MRIs. There are local, systemic, and common treatment options when tackling breast cancer. For local treatments, you can get surgery or radiation treatment. For systemic treatments, you can get chemotherapy, hormone therapy, targeted drug therapy, and immunotherapy. 
although most breast cancers are treated by stage. For more information on that, you can check out cancer.org or do research online. You can get involved in research, become a volunteer for breast cancer, become an advocate, or donate to charities that help out with breast cancer. Every little thing we do makes a difference. Now, you're a little more educated on the matter of breast cancer. It's time to make a difference and contribute to the cause. If you're concerned with what your chances of getting breast cancer are, you can get genetic counseling and see from there if you need to get tested for your risk of breast cancer by asking your doctor. Visit cancer.org for more information. You can also check out these charities if you want to help out. That's all I have for you today. Have a great day. That was your show, Center Hill, and here's the quote of the day. Courage doesn't always roar. Sometimes courage is a little voice at the end of the day that says, I'll try again tomorrow. By Mary Ann Rotemacher. Make sure you smash that like button, hit the bell so you don't miss an episode, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and don't forget to follow us on Twitter. Have a great day, Center Hill, and stay safe.